everyone. So today, welcome to Tadpoles Lesson 7. So today we're going to be doing fact families. So I'm going to show you how to do this. So they have gi given you four facts you need to list out on these three given numbers. So the first one has a plus. So we're adding something and something to get another number. So these three numbers are going to be the um, things that go in these boxes. So for example, we have 11, 3, and 14. So we could do 11 plus 3 equals 14. And that makes sense. So that would be our first fact. Uh, our second fact could be there's a plus, so it has to be 3 plus 11 equals 14. The next two are subtraction ones. So we would take a number uh, minus that from another number, and that should equal this number. So with these three numbers right here, which ones could I subtract and get another number? I could do 14 minus 3 equals 11, or I could do 14 minus 11 equals 3. And that's how we do these fact families. So that's how I do number one. For number two, we have one, three, and four. So for the first ones, we could add one to three equals four. And then we could switch that because since it's addition, it doesn't matter which one is first. So we could do three plus one equals four. Then for this one, we're always going to put the biggest number that we find, which is going to be four first. So these two are going to start with four, four, four. Four minus one equals three. And then we could switch that and do 4 minus 3 equals 1. For the next one, for number 3, we have 7, 4, and 11.
So what's our biggest number? Our biggest number is always going to go here for addition and first for subtraction. That's an easy way to figure that out. So we put the remaining two numbers here and then we could switch them. We just fill them in. 11 minus 4 equals 7 and 11 minus 7 equals 4. And that's how we do that. So we're going to use the same trick. We're going to put 17, our biggest number, over here for the addition ones, and then over here for the subtraction ones. So you could do 8 plus 9 equals 17, or 9 plus 8 equals 17. We could do 17 minus 9 equals 8, or 17 minus 8 equals 9. For this one, we have 1, 6, and 7. We're going to put 7 over here for addition and 7 over here for subtraction. You do 6 plus 1 equals 7, 1 plus 6 equals 7, 7 minus 6 equals 1, and then 7 minus 1 equals 6. For this one, we have 12, 2, and 14. We're going to put 14 here for the addition ones and 14 here for the subtraction ones. We could do 12 plus 2 equals 14, and then 2 plus 12 equals 14. 14 minus 2 equals 12, and then 14 minus 12 equals 2. And these are answers. Now I'm going to give you guys some time to work on these ones.
Okay, so you guys should be done by now. So we're gonna put our biggest number. So there's 10, three, and 13. We're gonna put 13 over here for the addition ones and then 13 over here for subtraction ones. So you could do 10 plus three equals 13. Three plus 10 equals 13. And then 13 minus 10 equals three or 13 minus three equals 10. If we have nine, one, and 10, we're gonna put 10 here and here. We could do nine plus one equals 10, one plus nine equals 10, 10 minus nine equals one, 10 minus one equals nine. For this one, between 12, five, and 17, 17 is gonna be our biggest number. So we're gonna put it in its appropriate spots. We're gonna do five plus 12 equals 17, 12 plus five equals 17, 17 minus 12, whoops, equals the remaining number, which is five. 17 minus five equals the remaining number, which is 12. For this one, out of six, nine, and 15, 15 is gonna be our biggest number. Then we're going to do 6 plus 9 equals 15, 9 plus 6 equals 15, 15 minus 6 equals 9, 15 minus 9 equals 6. The biggest number out of 7, 4, and 11 is 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11. 7 plus 4, 4 plus 7. 11 minus 7 equals 4, 11 minus 4 equals 7. We could we put our biggest number over here and over here. Eight plus seven equals fifteen, and then seven plus eight equals fifteen. Fifteen minus eight equals seven. Oops. And fifteen minus seven equals eight. And there are our answers. I'm gonna give you guys some time to work on this. And then we're going to go over the answers.
Okay, so we're going to put our biggest number over here. To over here. 6 plus 2 equals 8. 2 plus 6 equals 8. 8 minus 6 equals 2. 8 minus 2 equals 6. Put our biggest numbers. Twelve plus four, four plus twelve. Sixteen minus four equals twelve, and then sixteen minus twelve equals four. We have six, 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 and six. Five plus one, one plus five. Six minus five equals one. Six minus one equals five. 19 is our biggest number, so we're going to put it over here for addition, and then over here for subtraction. 11 plus 8, 8 plus 11, 9 minus 11 equals 8, and then 19 minus, oops, sorry, I said 9, 19 minus 11 equals 8, 19 minus 8 equals 11. Our biggest number out of 3, 5, and 8 is going to be 8, so we're going to put 8 over here for addition, 8 over here for subtraction. 5 plus 3 equals 8, 3 plus 5 equals 8, 8 minus 5 equals 3, and then 8 minus 3 equals 5. For this one, we're going to do the out of 7, 9, and 16. 16 is going to be the biggest. Oops. 7 plus 9 is 16, 9 plus 7 is 16, 16 minus 7 is 9. And 16 minus 9 is 7. We're going to pause and give you time to work on all of these.
Okay, so you guys should be done by now. Nine, 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 and nine. 8 plus 1 equals 9, 1 plus 8 equals 9, 9 minus 8 equals 1, 9 minus 1 equals 8. We can do 16, 16, 16, and 16. We have 10 plus 6 equals 16, 6 plus 10 equals 16, 16 minus 10 is 6, 16 minus 6 is 10. Out of 11, 4, and 15, 15 is the biggest. 11 plus 4 is 15, 4 plus 11 is 15, 15 minus 11 is 4, 15 minus 4 is 11. We're going to put 13 over here and over here. 8 plus 5 is 13, 5 plus 8 is 13, 13 minus 8 is 5, and 13 minus 5 is 8. We're going to put 10 over here and over here. 7 plus 3 is 10. 3 plus 7 is 10. 7 mi 10 minus 7 is 3. And then 10 minus 3 is 7. We're going to put 21 over here in the addition side. And then over here, subtraction side. 12 plus 9, 9 plus 12, 12, 21 minus 12 is 9, 21 minus 9 is 12. Pretty easy, right? Just going to scroll down here for more practice. Okay, so we're going to pause this one.
so out of this, four, five is going to be the biggest. Four plus one, one plus four, five minus four equals one, five minus one equals four. For this one, we're going to do 12, 12, 12, 12, 8 plus 4, 4 plus 8, 12 minus 8 equals 4, and then 12 minus 4 equals 8. The next one out of 7, 12, and 19, 19 is going to be the biggest. 12 plus 7. 7 plus 12, 19 minus 12 is um, 7, 19 minus 7 is 12. Eleven, 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 eleven. Six plus 5, 5 plus 6, 11 minus 6 equals 5, 11 minus 5 equals 6. For this one, out of 5, 2, and 7, 7 is going to be the biggest. So we're going to put it on the right of the addition problems and the left of the subtraction problems. 5 plus 2 is 7. 2 plus 5 is 7. 7 minus 5 is 2. And then 7 minus 2 is 5. For this one, out of 8, 9, and 17, 17 is going to be the biggest. We're going to put it over here. 8 plus 9 is 17, 9 plus 8 is 17, 17 minus 8 is 9, 17 minus 9 is 8. And then this will be our last set of problems. We're going to pause here. Oops.
for this one. Out of 8, 3, and 11. 11 is going to be the biggest. 8 plus 3. 3 plus 8. 8 minus, 11 minus 8 is 3. 11 minus 3 is 8. For 12, 8, and 20, 20 is going to be the biggest. 8 plus 12 is 20. 12 plus 8 is 20. 20 minus 8 is going to be 12. And then 20 minus 12 is going to be 8. Out of 6, 4, and 10, 10 is going to be the biggest. 6 plus 4 is 10. 4 plus 6 is 10. 10 minus 6 is 4. 10 minus 4 is 6. For 9, 5, and 14, we're going to put 14 over here and here. 9 plus 5, 5 plus 9. 14 minus 9 is 5. 14 minus 5 is 9. Out of 9, 4, and 13, 13 is the biggest. So we have, we're going to do 4 plus 9 is 13, and then 9 plus 4 is 13. 13 minus 9 is 4, and 13 minus 4 is 9. I don't know if you guys have seen this pattern, but for the addition problems, these two switch. And for the subtraction problems, these two switch. For our last problem, out of 11, 1, and 12, 12 is the biggest. So 11 plus 1 equals 12. 1 plus 11 equals 12. 12 minus 11 equals 1. And then 12 minus 1 equals 11. And that's our fact families.